With the huge success of Bird Box, Netflix is doubling down with this spin-off film. So, is this film going to be such a huge success and also something that is worth watching? Or is Netflix here to just steal more of our time? Come find out. Welcome to CNE here where you come for all of your media needs. My name is Ray and today I am reviewing Netflix original film Bird Box Barcelona. Directed by Alex Pastor, starring Mario Carsa. How many times can you make a monster film that people want to watch? The art of horror films is always a delicate line to try to balance on. You don't want to give the audience too much to where now they can pick apart the monster and the things surrounding the monster, but you don't want to give them too little to where they're not scared and cannot perceive or understand why the monster may or may not be doing what it's doing or how it is actually doing what it is doing. And I believe that Bird Box Barcelona treads this line delicately as well. I think they do a good job of not giving us too much about the monsters, but showing us a brand new perspective on the Bird Box franchise. And I like the characters in this film. Sebastian did a good job of making us believe what he believed in this film. I say that because I don't want to give spoilers away for those who want to see the film, a spoiler free. But I will say that the emotional roller coaster that Sebastian was taking us on in this film was done well. Sandra Bullock is a hard act to follow, and this film showed that the original Bird Box was so good because of Sandra Bullock and how the story was. I know that this movie went into a different direction, and I actually like that they tried something new to flush out the world of Bird Box, but I don't know if a lot of people really wanted another Bird Box film. I don't know if this will be watched just as much as a previous film was because, again, do we really care more and want to see more of Bird Box and of what is going on in there? I did enjoy this film. It wasn't great, and I might be open to a sequel if it's set in other places. I probably would definitely want to see one done somewhere in Asia, China, in that, in that area, right? I definitely would want to see one of those. But, again, I don't know if the audience is there for it, and I don't know if they're going to get enough viewership on this particular film to justify that. I know that you cannot open your eyes to see the monster, but you can open your eyes to see more of my content. If you are liking this review so far, make sure that you give it a like, and I will greatly appreciate that. The creatures are back, and they still hold that same potency of fear with the different ways to approach these creatures in this film i like the creativity and the writing done on that side and the creatures in this film still feel very ominous enough they still give off just enough level of fear to make certain scenes in this movie feel tense I do not believe that this horror film is anything that is worth putting on any sort of pedestal of best horror movies of this year. But I do believe that it was a decent attempt at a sequel for a franchise. I can't say franchise yet because I do not believe two films is a franchise. But what I can say is they are attempting to make something that could resemble a franchise if people liked this film. In conclusion, I'm not going to spend too much time on the Bird Box Barcelona, but I did want to at least give you my thoughts on how I felt about the film, and maybe it is worth some of your time if you enjoyed the first film a lot. But I will have to give this film a 6 out of 10. I do believe that this film is one of those films that will be forgotten later this year. If you enjoyed this review, make sure that you give it a like. If you want to see more of my content and more of me, make sure that you hit the notification bell and also subscribe so you can stay up to all of the content that I have to offer. And do not let the conversation end here. If you like Bird Box or like this film, let me know in the comments and we can have that conversation. And don't forget, you seen it here.